There are many highly sought after trophies in Australian sport. In Australian karting, the hottest property this year is the John Pizarro Trophy that will be awarded to the winner of the Pro Gearbox category in the CIK Stars of Karting Series. Pizarro, a 15 time Australian karting champion, is one of the all time greats in the sport, having also raced in the World Championships against Ayrton Senna during the late 1970s. Entering this weekend's final round of the 2010 Championship to be held at Port Melbourne in Victoria, five drivers are in with a shot at etching their name in Australian karting history. While he may have a 14 point buffer at the top of the Championship standings, Queenslander Kel Tresseter knows that the trophy is a long way from being his. This weekend there's 85 points up for grabs so it's, uh, it's going to be tough, you know, like uh, only a little bit of bad luck and especially the way the point structure works, you can um, easily close that gap. And it's not only Matt that's uh, in the hunt too, there's Troy Wollstone, there's uh, Jason Pringle, Chris Hayes. So I mean to say it's, uh, it's certainly not over, lots of points up for grabs and, and a foreign circuit to me as well. So it's, uh, it's all up in the air, it's anyone's race. Sitting second in the point standings is Victorian Matthew Wall. While this weekend is being held at his home circuit, the 32 year old is fully aware that he's got a lot of work to do if he's going to claim the title. Uh, definitely leaves on the line, but um, it's, I guess it's Carl's championship to lose and mine, mine to, to win. Uh, the bonus thing is that this is my home track and I've got to use that full advantage. Adding further pressure to the drivers is the fact that in addition to the perpetual trophy, the champion will get the opportunity to race at the Super Nats in Las Vegas during November. Last year's event featured seven-time Formula One world champion Michael Schumacher. I think firstly, there's two stages of this event. There's the John Pizarro Trophy and the CIK Championship up for grabs, but then second of all is the bonus, is the Las Vegas trip. I think um, both of them are equal, but there's, there's really two different goals there. And um, to, you know, to, to win the championship and then of course to go to Las Vegas is amazing. In other news around the track, Hayden McBride has just returned from Germany where he competed in a round of the German Championship as a part of his prize for winning the 2009 CIK Championship. Went over there and had a very challenging weekend. Um, we were lucky enough to come away with seventh. Um, we're pretty happy with that, but a yeah, great learning curve and um, it'd be good to see more Aussies overseas. Practice was held around the Port Melbourne circuit today and Luke May, the 2001 champion, in his return to karting, was one of the pace setters in the Pro Light Brigade. In the junior brigade, they're all chasing the series leader, Pierce Lahane, but Aidan Wright and James Macken appear to have closed the gap on the championship leader. Qualifying were held on Saturday, with the finals contested on Sunday.